Hello, my friends. Happy new week to you. Um, I'm going to be honest. I saw a note about daylight savings time up there. Yeah, it's kicking my butt. It's kicking my butt right now. So <laughs> welcome in, everybody. Um, I struggled to get out of bed this morning. It was lately. It had been light. How's it going? What's up, Mike? Illini predictions going all the way, baby. You know it. You know it. I'm putting it on. I'm putting it down in my bracket. They're winning the whole dang thing. We're gonna do it. Oh baby. Oh, it was such a good weekend. That's another reason. I think I'm just still trying to recover from that game yesterday. Uh, the blood pressure was raised for a few hours. So, uh, yeah, daylight savings time is just. It's just the worst. Let's just not ever do it again. Let's just keep the time as it is forever. Um, because it doesn't make any sense anyway. You know, I heard like several years ago, it's like cutting the end of a blanket off and sewing it on at the top and thinking you made yourself a longer blanket. Um, that feels pretty accurate. So that feels pretty accurate. So, yeah, we lost an hour of sleep um, Saturday night into Sunday, but Sunday I get to sleep in. So not quite as noticeable but how you doing fry guy nitalicious extreme how you guys doing today but yeah nitalicious you're right it is daylight savings time ended so uh yeah normally it would be 7 13 my time but now it's 8 13 so time doesn't really exist it's a figure of speech and it's true the concept Intro is so over ambitious. Like, will we will bring gold? Epic quest, slay monstrous beasts, and bring gold glory to our kingdom and guild. How will you do that? Harvesting turnips. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. There is no daylight savings time in Pelican Town, though. Thankfully, maybe if you played Skyrim, <clears throat> I considered it. I considered it, but there's two other games that I've been really wanting to play that we're going to be playing later on this week. So. But yeah, Extreme, you're 100% right. That's how all the great adventures start. We're basically in the Shire right now. You know what I mean? We're in the Shire. Mordor's coming, you know? We're just in the Shire for now. Oh. <laughs> Wait, kind of like money. Daylight savings time is kind of like money? You're not hitting daylight savings time till the 28th. Oh, okay. So almost two weeks. November, it changes again. I know, right? <laughs> pretty chill that's good 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 doing some work oh money doesn't exist all relative made up yeah true true i mean honestly like especially the fact that like the vast majority of money in our society now is all digital you know and i don't mean like cryptocurrencies i'm talking like like even dollars dollars and cents like you've got i mean i have a number in my bank account but i've never seen that money before Never seen the tangible money before. <laughs> I came to a part in the packing down that is throwing throw out stuff you don't need. Oh, turns out we had a lot of booze that was way too old. So flush that all down the drain. So I'm sitting on in all the fumes. Oh, geez. <laughs> now that's a interesting, interesting day there, Extreme. Don't mock my changing train of thought while writing these made up dialogues. It's all good. I just, I was trying to, I was like, dang, what, uh, I, normally what I do in my brain is I try to correct, if I see a typo, I try to correct it as I read it out loud, and I was like, I don't know what I should correct this to. That's all it was. Oh, of course I remember Chaotic. Chaotic's been around for a long time. And it's been around a long time. What's going on, Clueless? If you see me doing something weird, that'll be my excuse, right? Can't stay for long, gotta go on a walk with my cat in like 20 minutes. Oh, you walk your cat? How does that go? How is that experience? Because I only ever owned a few cats, but uh, none of them were walking material. They were... Uh, pretty much all of them were pretty independent, so... Pretty much all of them. <clears throat> He's a good boy, he likes to accompany us. Nice! I guess cat walks, you walk, you walk together. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It... I let my bird fly on a small string slash leash. Really? 
Doesn't like leashes, so just follows. Okay. Yeah, if I would have done that with my cats growing up, they'd be gonzo. Like, just... See ya. <laughs> Never to be seen again. Never to be seen again. Rescued a cat with a buddy in college. The cat will follow his mom on walks with their dog to this day. Very interesting. Wait, really? Is that Was that in your hometown or was that near, like, Kenosha? That's so sweet. Yeah, Mrs. Magoots and I rescued a cat. Um, it had, like, singed whiskers, so we thought maybe it survived a fire somehow or maybe it just went near a bonfire. We don't know exactly, but um, nobody was looking for it. And uh, we ended up keeping it for a little while, but it almost killed my mom. So my mom had to get rid of it. <clears throat> I have told this story before, but she was just a very hyper cat. And so she would come out of the shadows and like attack my mom's feet. Just come running out of nowhere, <whistles> attack her feet. She's about to go down the stairs. And my mom's like, I'm too old for this. I'm going to trip, fall and die. I, I, I can't do this. So. Found the cat in Kenosha with Team Dan. Nice. Lives with his mom now. Didn't know that. My girlfriend and I just rescued one last month as well. So three floofs in the house. Wow. I didn't know that, man. Team Dan. Hope Team Dan's doing good. I haven't talked to him in a while. But. <clears throat> and you rescued one last month. Wow. Dang, man. <laughs> Does, uh... Does Rizzo get along with cats? Lives up here in Minneapolis, actually. See him and Kendra a bit. I Nice. Okay, sweet. That's awesome, dude. Yeah, I uh, like to do some sort of get-together. Obviously, like, homecoming is always a good one. Um, you know, if we can have a homecoming this, this year, that'd be great to see everybody. Let's just uh, get rid of coronavirus real quick. I'm not already getting work messages, am I? That would be about the worst. Nope. Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Okay. Currently launching Stardew Valley so we can get our chill Monday up and running. Oh, and I think we need a chill start to the week. We started year two uh, late last week. And so far, so good. I think I'm currently, uh, I already harvested the first round of turnips, parsnips, call them turnips, parsnips. And we're on our wild seeds now. I'm not sure what I'm going to plant next. I don't have anything in the keg or reserves jar, though. Both the dogs love the cat. Nice. She's alpha at six pounds. We'll see what happens. But yeah, I miss people. On that note, I got weekend emails to catch up on Blue Lurking with this chill star. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it, dude. Hope the emails go well. What else? What? I mean, I'll throw hops in the... I'm not going to pickle any more hops. Ooh, a spice berry? Maybe I'll throw a spice berry in there. I don't know if it'll let me. Find out. Technically, it's a foraged item. It still let me, though. I'll get some berry jam. Oh my goodness. Look at the greenness. It is pretty jarring after being in winter for so long, or what felt like so long. It was nice, though. Winter was my favorite season. I honestly didn't think that would be the case. This one there. What if the guild had their own currency? Oh, like how? The goat can be milked. Well, if I actually click on. Oh, it has no milk right now. Interesting. Okay. Maybe the goat can't be milked every day. Try to pet the chickens. We petted all of our farm animals now. Got to keep them happy. 
Welcome in, Michael. How are you doing? Goat is every other day. Gotcha. Thanks for that. Thanks for that tip. Appreciate that. I wasn't entirely sure. Um, so remember, we're not gonna we're not gonna try to convert iridium eggs into mayonnaise because for whatever reason, you don't get a iridium mayonnaise. You just don't get one. Uh, spring after winter is the best season for me. I love that life after everything was dead and cold. In, are you saying IRL? Or are you saying in this game? Ooh, honey. Okay, throw the mayonnaise in there and the iridium egg. I don't know if I've sold an iridium egg yet. I just want to see how much they're worth. I feel like I might have at some point, but I just don't really remember. Did I miss an egg? Or were there only three? Winter sucks because you have to forage and not lose your hay. That's true. True, true, true. Speaking of, though, I mean, I don't really even have very much hay right now. I got to feed the animals again. I'm going to have 20 pieces of hay after this. In game and just oh, wait, both in game and IRL gotcha. What do chickens need? They need hay. Really, they should. They should eat something other than hay, but you know, it's, mine are kind of picky, so they only eat hay. Got some oak resin. Any others? Nope. And then we'll pick all the mushrooms, and then it'll be like ten thirty. A hundred chickens. Wait. Oh, you have nineteen silos. Are you serious? And a hundred chickens. You just a big fan of the chickens. Love being a chicken farmer. All right, I've been storing this resin. Not really sure what for, but. Did I save any honey? I thought I was saving resin. Maybe. Oh, uh, you know what? I think I donated the other resin. Anything in here? I should take all this other stuff that I'm not going to keep and sell it to the Adventurers Guild. That's what I should do today. But they don't open until 2. Like these things. Let me get a little extra for them. Fire quartz. I need... I need to donate that. So maybe I do some donations. Uh, that's. I'm not going to have enough inventory space, though. I could go buy the backpack. Should I do that? Oh, I was saving up for the big barn, right? Bring Emily an apricot. I could buy some tree saplings as well. It's just tough. What should I do? Idle pirate, welcome in. How you doing today? Welcome to the stream. Crack the fancy geodes. Could do that. I kind of liked the first spelling though. Croc. Like croc on crate of the Witcher 3. <clears throat> but, uh, <laughs> I don't know. It's tough because, again, I want to be able to make a mill so I can work on rice. But in order to get the rice or the mill, I need cloth. I've got my loom over here. But in order to spin for cloth, I need wool. And in order to get wool, I need sheep. In order to get sheep, I need a deluxe barn. So it's just like. Oh, it's just so much. And I mean, I could earn that much, but like you see, I'm at 1200 or 12,000 right now and it takes 25,000. So it's like, am I, am I okay enough to be able to save? Am I gonna be able to do that? So that's why I'm kind of thinking maybe mining. Let's see. I looked at living off the land. Got a kitchen. Yeah. Cooking is a great way to enhance your abilities. Not only do they provide a convenient source of energy. Rob. Beezy? Robzy. Robzy. That's it. I feel better about saying Robzy. Cheers. Thank you for the follow, my new friend. Welcome into the stream. Cheers to you. Just started this game yesterday, so came to get ideas and stuff. Can't wait to get back into it later. Oh, Idle Pirate. Be careful. It is a dangerously addictive game. <laughs> but I'm sure if you've played it even just for a few minutes, you already know that. Many dishes temporarily increase your skill, speed, and more. Smells good, don't it? 
Another sunny day. It really didn't rain a lot, I feel like. Oh, good fortune day. Robsy was taking so I had to go with a butchered spelling of it. Thank you for the welcome. Anytime, anytime. How you doing? Let's see. Does it tell me if any of these improve? Oh, it does. It does tell me the stat boosts. Is there anything I make that boosts speed? Three farming, though. Oh. Plus three foraging. That's another thing, too. I'm not sure. Like, does that mean I pick up items faster? Like, what does that even mean when you get plus three? Miner's treat. Oh. I don't have any sugar, but like, that would be a really good one to take with me into the mines. That's basically like a, a mushroom. That's a purple mushroom, but with magnetism and mining ability. So kind of like my naming scheme I had for my animals. I named uh, my two pigs uh, Elsie and Edith. Did I say that right? After my mother-in-law's chocolate labs, who are little piggies. The goats are called Trip, Trap, and Troll, which is the Swedish names for the goats that cross the bridge with a troll. Nice. Hope that fairy tale is international. I'm trying to think of a goat version of that. I don't know... I don't know that I've heard that one, actually. Boyd chickens are Damien, Chucky, Jason, and Freddy. Nice. And my personal favorite, the ducks, Donald, Daffy, and Pe Pecking. Nice. Peeking, Pecking. Actually, so, yeah. Peeking. I, I always said Peeking, but then when I was in China, they said Pecking, so. Here's a life sucker indeed. Probably why I can't wait to continue later. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. Chickens are Dutch for chicken one through a hundred. <laughs> What the H is magnetism do in this game? Uh, basically all the... What's going on, Phil the Potato? All the items that are, like, available picked up, they just sort of, like, get... You just suck them up. Without having to actually move over the top of them. Roots platter. Oh! Cave carrot and winter roots. Maybe I should have been saving those... Maybe I should have been saving those, uh... Winter roots after all. I kept selling them because nobody likes them. Artichoke dip. Any of these provide a speed boost? If I could get a speed boost, that would be... I mean, I've got one coffee, but I'm saving it for the egg festival so I can win. That's my plan, at least. I don't know if it's going to work. I'm going to do my best. Do I have any honey in here already? I don't. Okay. My containers are getting a little full. Let me move these rices over. Okay. Um, yeah, let's, let's try to sell some crap to the Adventurer's Guild, maybe process some geodes too, but we'll see here. Slingshot, okay, leather boots, cutlass, hopefully these are worth something, I have no idea. I haven't sold a single thing to the Adventurer's Guild yet. Leprechaun shoes, I do really like those, but I've got some good ones now. Mm -hmm. I should definitely sell the regular slingshot now that I have a master slingshot. I've never used a master slingshot, though. Ours all, you'll get into a state where you'll just store and hoard everything. Crops, loots, treasure, artisans and all because you'll have more money than you need. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking, too. Eventually, at some point, right? Okay, so now I can carry the Omni Geodes. Michael W13, thank you for that follow, my new friend. Cheers and welcome to the guild. Cheers to you. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Um, oh, I should make some gold bars too while I'm at it, right? One geode. Anything else I should bring to the blacksmith? I could donate that to Gunther right there. Might as well. Adventurer's Guild doesn't open for another couple hours, though, so. Another couple hours. Yeah, I'll come back and make some gold bars probably at the end of the day. Oh, a magma geode. I didn't even see that. Okay. Let's do that one first. Okay. I can only crack open the single geode right now until the Adventurer's Guild opens and I can sell some of this. Unless I want to spend 10k on the backpack upgrade. I'm kind of considering it because honestly, oop, missed those worms. I won't be able to pick them up anyway, so I'll get them on the way back, I guess. 
Backpack Geodes Guild, you think so? Yeah, maybe I should. I should just do that. And then we're just going to start from scratch as far as building the deluxe barn. Looking for a coconut. I've got that. Pay a flat rate on delivery. Okay. Got a coconut. At least one. How far out are we from the egg festival? Okay. I might not get there today. May or may not. What up, what up, Abigail? What up, Shouty? Purchase it. Let's do it. Is this the max backpack now? Deluxe pack? Okay. All right. I just, I sucked it up. I just, I sucked it up and purchased it. Backpack should always be a priority because carrying more items means less lead time for everything after that. True. You're not wrong. You're not wrong at all, of course. Let me, uh, get up these worms now. Some mixed seeds? No freaking way. Hey, Abigail, if I find something beautiful in these geodes, it's yours, all right? All right, BB. Town's currency is so bad. 10,000 for a backpack. It's probably, you know, not the strongest currency, yeah. All right. Let's process the regular geode. Five stone. That's the worst. <laughs> That's probably the worst. All right, what do we got in these magmas, though? Ten coppers. Okay. Uh, Fifteen coppers. Okay. That was pretty anticlimactic. Come on, Clint. What are you doing? Okay, I do need that. I do need that. Uh, Clint! The heck is wrong with you, man? Give me something good instead of this poop pile. Oh my gosh, that that sucked. Phil, enjoy the lurk, my man. Does luck affect geodes? Uh, I don't know. It's a luck. It was it was a really lucky day. That was terrible, though. That was easily the worst. I mean, five Omni geodes and I got like an earth crystal, a poop stone and regular stone. And that's it. I don't even have anything to donate to Gunther, but I can go to the Adventurers Guild now. That was bad. He steals my good stuff. You're probably not wrong, but he does. He's like, you know what? You steal my girl, Emily, and I'm going to steal your treasures. I didn't actually steal his girl, but she did kiss me. So it's, I mean, it's not my fault. I did exactly what he told me to do. I gave her a present. I said, this is from Clint. And she goes, oh, that's cool. <laughs> like, all right, well, I mean, what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? I'm just a man in a hat, you know? In a skull t-shirt. When is brushing the golden gems into the dust of the crash, crushed geode? Only found these pieces of stone. Better luck next time, right? All right. Need a new sword? No, but I need to sell you some stuff. Not the obsidian, though. All right, how much are we going to get for all this? Could be a decent... Could be a decent little haul for all of it. Yeah, all right. Not bad. Not bad. It was almost two, two grand. I can't sell the slingshot, though. That's interesting. Who would I sell that to? Templar's Blade. Does he have an obsidian edge? He's he's got slingshots right here. Why can't I sell one to him? Seems kind of sketch. Hmm. I think I have Firewalker boots right now. Hateress, good morning to you and welcome into the stream. <laughs> right. Hey, what's going on? The zone. How you doing? Welcome back in. Hope you had a good weekend. Finds one thousand carat diamond. His brain, mine. I mean, I cracked this geode open. You just found it. Steel Falcon. Is that how you pronounce that? I, I, like, I wish I could compare it. Like, if I hover over my obsidian edge, it doesn't tell me anything about it. I think this one is better, though. I think it's better. Let's see. 
30 to 45 minus one speed plus 10 crit power. Okay, that one was plus four speed and 20 crit power. Yeah, so it's better. It is definitely better. Doing pretty well, Tater S. How about yourself? Oh, a rabbit. Do you actually have to slice rabbits to get their feet? Or is that just the game like making me think that when I see rabbit's foot like the wizard wants a rabbit's foot do I actually have to kill a rabbit for it or am I gonna just find them like loot laying around and I don't actually have to do the dirty work because that would be ideal I'd rather just be a scavenger as opposed to a rabbit murderer you know we talked about it no killing rabbits but what if they're already dead what if they're already dead I know I don't want to kill any rabbits Tateress, cheers to you. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Welcome to the guild, my new friend. Cheers to you. One place that is impossible to reach in Stardew. Is that right? Is that so? Mm, does that be you like daffodils? That's all I got on me right now. It's a normal gift for her. Okay. I'll pass then. I shall pass on giving her that. Mm, I don't know if I have any amethyst. What's going on, Vice by Vice? Should I ask what's in the mug? Well, the uh, we got two mugs here. Let me show you. Let me show you. So the, the big mug, the cheersy mug, you know, when somebody follows, I, you got to give them a cheers and welcome to the guild. This is a hand-painted Sea of Thieves mug. That's why it doesn't look very good, because yours truly painted it, and I'm not artistic. Um, but it's just water. I don't know if you can see. It's just water in there. I painted the inside blue because the Order of Souls like mug in Sea of Thieves, is it, it glows blue. That's why I did that. So, cheers. And then the... So that's just, you know, the regular. And then we've got the waking mug, okay? The mug of waking, if you will which this has my Doberman. This is my Doberman Ginny. So um, that is my actual dog. That's a painting of, of her. Now, I did not paint this because, as I said, I'm not a good painter. This is my dog. Um, it is like a, an artist rendition of an Instagram picture that Mrs. Magoots took that um, our um, sister-in-law purchased for Christmas. So... So that's the that's the coffee mug. You can see this one's coffee. So yeah, those are the two mugs of the day. <clears throat> you can, but we'll be disappointed. Yeah, <laughs> it is. Keep in mind, I'm in the United States. It is 8:40 a.m. here. 8:40 <laughs> a.m. So, uh, but also as a side note, I don't partake in alcoholic beverages. Just in general. They can drop his loot. When you find an enemy that drops it, you're going to be like, ooh, that makes sense. Oh, okay. All right. I haven't played in a while. Is that a mod that shows their love gifts, et cetera? Is that... Uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, maybe it was an update. This is I, this is the thing about me. I only, I only have played um, version 1.5. I started playing right after 1.5 came out. So I don't have anything... I don't have anything to compare it to on that Tateress. How do you now in the game? So I'm good catching the streams again. All right. Gotcha. Gotcha. Water. Okay. Okay. I see you. <laughs> I have a dino egg that just hatched and I have a baby dino. Oh, looks adorably derpy. She can definitely be derpy. Definitely. So I'll be looking into dinos next. I believe they're rare. Oh, like in Stardew, you've got dinos. Nothing wrong with a little water at 840. <laughs> Seems been a lot of quality of life and additional content changes 1.5. Nice. Okay. Yeah. So you guys, the way you guys are seeing the game right now, this is the only way I've experienced the game uh, because I was so late to the Stardew party. So incredibly late. I forgot I was going to look at the uh, mayonnaise machine. Copper bar and wood. Okay. I'm going to build another mayonnaise machine. Since I have four chickens, I'm going to try to get four mayonnaise machines. Copper bar. Uh, oh, I'm going to have to make one. Okay. We'll just do some mining, I guess. Or uh, smelting. We'll do some smelting. Lima Bean, howdy and welcome to you. Welcome to the stream. 
Hope you're having a nice day. Grab this wood. So, oh, look at that. Do you guys see how much wood that is? 69. <laughs> nice. Zero. 690. Pretty nice amount of wood there. You're on your eighth year? Are you serious? Dang, you are dedicated, Pry Guy. I'm only in year two. I am only in year two myself. All right, let's craft this mayonnaise machine. Oh, I have to actually make, I forgot, I have to actually make the copper bar. <laughs> nice. Did something terrible in the game? What'd you do? What did you do? I forgot I have four furnaces now. I, yeah, I'm in my second year, Lima Bean. Uh, it feels like the first year, though. The first year totally flew by. <clears throat> Although not in, not actually. Um, I don't know. It just, it, it's just kind of, it's just wild to think back. Like when I did start the game, it doesn't feel like it was that long ago, you know? Okay, now let's make the mayonnaise machine. I asked Abigail to be my girlfriend and then cheated on her with Penny? How dare you? How dare you? Now Penny is my only girlfriend. Wow. Well, this one's for you. You done been clowning around, son. You done been clowning. Wow. How could you? How dare you do that to Abigail? <laughs> right? All right, there's nowhere to put this mayonnaise machine, so let's put it right there. Now I can actually get caught up on some mayonnaise production. Sort of. Not, not actually. I still make four eggs a day. Uh, Cheese press, though? How much was that? Just extra hardwood. Okay. Cheated on three people? Good grief, you guys. You know what's weird? The characters don't care if you have multiple girlfriends. Oh, is it only... It's only, um... It's only in when you're married? Is that it? Or how's that work? Stream deck or something tactile? Uh, it's not. It is not. It is a, uh... It's a tablet, actually. It was Clint Abbey and the wizard. <laughs> the wizard? Dang. And to be honest, I never looked at uh, M. Rasmodius that way. Right? That's him, right? Uh, let's do some more smelting. Also, just like saying the word smelting. I need 15 of these. Probably should have done the other way, but it's fine. Okay. Making some gold bars. Oh, yeah. Now, if only I could make iridium bars. Of course, I said that about gold when I was just making silver bars. But, you know. Throw these in. Mudstone? I mean, do I really need this? Should I save the mudstone? I've already donated it. It looks like a big pile of poop. Oh. Uh, I think when you're married, they get a little jealous if you give anyone else gifts. Oh, is that right? What the? Yeah, that's what I say in the zone. Use touch portal app. Uh, I'm using, uh, what is it called? Matric. Matric. I don't think you can tell what he's on live on stream. <laughs> Wait, what? I'm going with Penny now. Definitely, she's the best girl. Is that right? Maybe Clint likes it. I could see Clint being into it. I could see that. Um, I would not romance. Wait, is Clint actually? Clint's not even single, though. I don't believe you. I no longer believe you. 
I married Leah. She's so sweet. Yeah, Leah. Leah is. So these are the three that I was sort of keeping my options open on in case I happen to make somebody really mad for whatever reason. I've got Abigail, Leah and Emily are the three I'm sort of leaning to. Uh, early on in the game, I was going after Haley, but then I realized Haley's the worst. So we're done. <clears throat> he gives you gifts if you get a higher friendship, though. Are you talking about Clint? Does he really? Clint has pretty much been my arch nemesis so far. Pretty much my arch nemesis. Him and I do not like each other. I mean, I just hope he doesn't get in my face, because I'll drop him. <clears throat> Clinton has a thing for someone else, though. Oh, yeah. Yep. And that person has a thing for me, so. Sips tea. <laughs> Haley is so mean, yeah. I asked her to dance with me at the Egg Festival, or uh, the whatever it was. Not the Egg Festival. The other spring dance, and she said, ew, no. So, yeah, we're done. I cried for a little bit, and now we're done. Uh, do I have two things to donate? The skeletal tail. Wasn't there something else? Lima bean. Cheers, and thank you for the follow, my new friend. Welcome to the guild. Cheers to you, lima bean. <laughs> what a chad, right? <laughs> Got that ew as well. Isn't it just a little bit extra? You know what I'm saying. And by a little bit, I mean a lot of bit extra. Haley is actually really nice to you after like four hearts. Yeah, well, here's the thing, though. You don't always get a second chance. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You don't always get a second chance. So now, she'll never know. She'll never know what she missed out on. Let me do some stone breaking. Flap and Shad. That's a fun name to say. Flap and Shad. Cheers. Thank you for the follow and welcome to the stream. Cheers to you, Flap and Shad. I think in relationships is the thing I focused least on in this playthrough. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people do that. It's hard, though. I mean, there's just so many different things you can focus on. Shane is actually a super great character once you get friendly with him. I keep hearing that. I keep hearing that. Playing hard to get. <laughs> Yo, how's Stardew going? Oh, it's been so much fun. It's been so much fun. I, I just started playing this. Did I start playing it in February? Or was it maybe late January? I don't remember, but uh, it, it hasn't been very long. Um, and I've been just like, wow, I really been missing out, you know? So it's been going extremely well. Are you a Stardew fan yourself, Flappin' Shad? To clear some stone here. Um, at least as much as I can. Really want to bust that chunk up. Makes me think of Joe Dirt, though. It's a big old me and you, meteor. That's what I keep thinking of. My best friend on the farm, other than Spanky, of course. Did you settle on a game rotation, by the way? I did. I did. I It was a tough decision, but I've got a rotation figured out. At least for this upcoming, like this, this week. I'm just going to throw the mudstone in there, and that might be a terrible idea, but I'm going to do it. And that's a silver star daffodil, so I'm going to throw that in there, too. Started playing slash streaming it for the first time a week ago. Loving it. Just got to year two. Same, 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 same. This is uh, spring. The eighth of spring, year two for me. When one shall reach year eight, much sadness will be brought. Is that right? I'm a lurk. Good luck. Appreciate it, Vice Five Vice. I'll do my best. I will do my absolute best. Year eight, huh? Year eight. I wonder how long that's going to take me to get. It's going to take me a while. Okay, so I just, I'm stuck with this slingshot, apparently. I don't really like that. I don't know what to do with it. Maybe, oh, you know what? Why don't I just throw it in here? Can I throw it in there? I didn't even look. I probably can't, though. I can't. Yeah, of course. 
So, wh like, what do you do? What do you do with a regular slingshot when you have a master slingshot? Hmm. Oh, the coconut. Uh, that needs to go to Elliot. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hang on to that for a sec. Hey, welcome back in, Mad Hatter. How you doing today? I'm doing pretty well. Thanks for asking. Just about at the same place. Nice. You're seven, Lima Bean. Dang. About three months if you really grind out. Yeah, that's impressive. Cause, uh, I mean, I don't play. I only get to play this game for a few hours at a time. I'm just gonna go ahead and go to bed. We'll catch Elliot tomorrow for the coconut. I need these days to be big days, and that's not big enough. Poopstone's only worth 25, so... Hmm. Hmm. Foraging was, you know, somewhat good to me. Farming, though? That large egg was 190 versus a mayonnaise, 285. So, I should still, even the, the uh, iridium eggs should still break down into mayonnaise. Interestingly enough... Iridium milk is worth more than a gold cheese. So that's kind of the weird part. At least it's weird to me. All right. These should be done pretty soon, I imagine. Good, thanks. Glad to hear that. Glad to hear that. Did you have a good weekend? Weekend for me was, uh, was pretty, oh, I didn't need to water that one. It was pretty good. My favorite basketball team won their tournament that they were in. They won the Big Ten tournament, which is awesome. Are these ready to be harvested? Hmm, I don't think just yet, but what happened to that one? That's weird. That one did not survive for some reason. Make a lot of money from the mayonnaise. Oh yeah. What about iridium cheese? Um, it doesn't seem to be making iridium cheese for some reason. I don't know if I'm just not good enough at cheese making. But when I put iridium, ir yeah, when I put an iridium milk in there, it came out as it came out as gold uh, cheese. So I don't know, maybe I'm just not very good at it for some reason, but. A cheese. We get a gold cheese there. Throw the goat milk in. I am an Illinois fan in the zone. I am, I am. Grew up, uh, I grew up 10 minutes from the university. So my hometown team, you know. How's the community center? Wait, got a crow? Oh, crows, that's right. I didn't even put my scarecrows out. Let me go do that right now before I forget. I've got a bunch of scarecrows just sitting here. Oh, look, another diamond. Should I sell these? I've got seven. What do you think, should I sell them or should I, should I give them away? I've got three rare crows and then one scarecrow. I'll put them all out. I don't care. I don't care if I don't have enough land for all of them. I'll do it anyway. How's that? Actually, I'm gonna put some up here too. I know it's probably not the prettiest arrangement, but you know what? Screw these scarecrows, or these crows. The scarecrows not screw them, they're good. But through the crows. Uh, so flipping Shad, the community center, I've got like, uh, how many rooms? Two, three rooms finished? Three rooms finished. Three rooms finished. I got the vault, the boiler room, and the art or er, arts room, crafts room, whatever it was called, craft room. Uh, so I saw the fish tank, the bulletin board, and one other room that I can't remember right now which one. <laughs> Had my COVID vaccine on Saturday, but I only got a headache from it, so not bad, I guess. That's good. That's good. Uh, Mad Hatter, I got my COVID vaccine, my first dose, uh, Wednesday of last week, and I felt really, really good. And I noticed I have actually been having some side effects. Um, 
they're almost gone, I think, but I, I actually had some bumps on the back of my hands, like like my palms, back of my palms here. Um, and those are almost gone now, uh, but I didn't even notice it at first, to be honest. And then um, I've also just been feeling pretty tired. And I think that's from, I think it could potentially be from the vaccine. I'm not sure, but. Iridium is an ore, uh, not a milk product. So what do you call these purple stars then? If you've got silver, gold, and then what's this color star then? I've been calling it an Iridium star. Don't know a ton about NCA, but I'm heavy NBA fan though. I'm the exact opposite. Don't really watch the NBA, but a uh, big NCAA fan. Why have some of the crops gone dry, forgot to water, or wait, someone went dry? Should watch Avak, he does Stardew. Okay. Fertilizer? Could be. Yeah, it could be. Oh, you're so oh, I'm uh could it be the sprinkler? Using iridium as a quality identifier. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 sure. It's void, but I still say iridium. Oh, it's called void, okay. On my way with the community center, I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best. Iridium star. So okay, so some say void, some say iridium. Okay. Right. Void be the best quality. It's more quality level. See, void makes me think like void. Void quality is in like void of quality, like no quality. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Also, since we're talking about void, it makes me think of uh, Subnautica. So very tired lately. What vaccine? Um, I got the Pfizer vaccine. Pfizer. Void egg is completely different from iridium. Void quality doesn't exist. It's a separate thing. OK, OK. Hmm. Hmm. I'll still throw the eggs in there because, like I said, a gold star, a gold star um, <clears throat> mayonnaise is still worth more. So yeah, do the do the presses, the cheese press, does it not make a, a uh, higher than a gold star cheese? Because I haven't gotten any higher than a gold star mayonnaise either. Um, and the large uh, iridium star milk sells for more than a gold star cheese. That's kind of what I've been doing. <clears throat> Guess what? I went on a hike Sunday and got exposed to radiation. Wait, radiation burns? Wait, are you serious? Are you trolling me right now? Are you serious? AstraZeneca? I gotcha. Okay. Hopefully you're feeling okay otherwise, Mad Hatter. Void chicken. Oh, void chicken makes void egg. Oh, something a little different. Okay. Stardew says this. Uh, Stardew Wiki says this. Base quality, uh, silver star times 1.25. Gold star times 1.5. Iridium star times 2. Nice. Okay. Iridium milk wouldn't be void in any way. Gotcha. Okay. You have to upgrade your house in order to increase the quality of your cheese, but that's something you'll see later in the game. Gotcha. Yeah, the, the house upgrade is expensive. Real expensive. Super expensive. I'm not quite there yet. I'm trying to get this uh, deluxe barn. That's what I would like to do so I can get some sheep and some wool so I can make some cloth, turn out some uh, cl uh, cloth on the looms, so then I can make rice. It's just a heck of a process to get there. Oh, the gold bars are done, though. Let's do some more smelting then. Uh, one gold bar. Can I make I can make three coppers? So let's do that. Then I need four coals. Did I pet the chickens? I don't think I did. I'll probably do that. All right. It's the house is the TARDIS. Frames be dropping. My side are loots. Uh, I I am dropping some frames periodically. Yeah. Yep. I sure am. Uh, my internet has not seemed to be as stable lately. I don't know what's going on. Don't know what's going on. So. <clears throat> An arm and a leg. It is. It is. For the second dose, the vaccine comes pretty commonly with flu-like symptoms, so I'm load up on vitamin C before you get that one. Next couple days after. Yeah, I'm a little bit worried about that because it comes. My second dose of the vaccine comes right as the track team that I coach will be starting their competitions. Uh, but my thought was like it's better to have those early in the season for these other these meets versus like in the postseason when a lot of other people are going to be getting vaccinated. So that's sort of my thought. And that's another thing, too, as a coach, like. 
Like, I, I don't know when my athletes are going to be able to get the vaccine, but I feel like I have to tell them to get it when they're able to, you know? And it might very well be by the end of the... It might be at the end of the season, and it's like, so they might be having some symptoms. I don't know. I'd feel terrible for them if they worked all that time and then, you know, vaccine symptoms took over, but it's just something that's like, it's got to be bigger than, than, you know, athletics, unfortunately, so... A lot of my military friends did that and didn't have symptoms for too long. That's good. For those that have done, is the basement worth money? Oh, that's a good question. Is it for wine storage? Ah. I'll get it then. So cool. My brother coaches track as well. Really? What level? Um, is today my last day? Yeah, I gotta go find Elliot. Let's go find Elliot. Maybe pluck this daffodil while I'm at it. Two daffodils. Mushrooms, yep, yep. Give those weird containers with spirals on them. Spirals. Hmm. This could be you talking in code so I don't learn the spoilers. I don't know. <laughs> All right, I know where Elliot lives. I don't know if he's going to be around his house, though. Let's see, I've seen him on the beach and the dock and stuff plenty of times. Always had a huge passion for track. Same, 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 same. Oh, the coconut I requested, and it's a beautiful one, too. Thank you very much, Lutz. You've got it, Elliot. A great idea can pass through your head when you least expect it, but if your mind is too busy, you might miss it. Shoot. I really must get back to my work. And that one spoke to me. <laughs> Cast. My second vax is three days after my birthday. Oh, okay. Well, I guess at least you get to have a healthy birthday. <laughs> you know? Hopefully. Doing a little foraging. Can't hurt to have a little bit, uh... Some things to sell, I guess. Nothing else. Also will be getting a new word on the lockdown today. Hopefully they'll open up a little. Been sponsoring a member at my gym for five months. <laughs> Oh, man. Yeah, I I do miss the gym. Uh, I'll be honest with you guys, though. The, since I started streaming at this time, uh, because I'm pretty much always available in the morning, what I used to do, though, was I would go to the gym in the mornings. So I was actually trying to think about it. I was like, when should I lift now if I do go back to the gym? Because I am not going to give up streaming and lift in the mornings again. So what should I do? I gotta have to go evenings. Just high school, we both did track in high school together, but he just got out of the military a couple months ago, so he started this season. Nice, okay. That's $100 I could spend on something else. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, high school's great, though. Like, I I, I kind of, I don't know. I, I was always drawn to high school because I feel like I can, I don't know. I I can interact with those, like, that, that age better. Um, And then also just the fact that, like, it's cool that you don't really get to choose your kids. You know what I mean? Like at college, you recruit your own kids, which is cool. Don't get me wrong. But like in high school, you just kind of have to like do the best with what you're given. You know, uh, you can still recruit kids from the school. Like if a kid is not doing track, you can try to convince them to do track. But again, like you're still just limited on who's going to be there. So it's kind of cool to, uh, you know, try to build something. I don't know. And the school I coach at is not does not have a rich history uh, of really any athletics, but especially not track. Really colorful. Mind if I ask what camera you're using? I'm using the C920, Logitech C920. Sebastian sucks. Wait, why don't you like Sebastian? Chunk, and welcome into the stream. No gym for you then. Yeah, I'm going to have to figure something out. I don't know. 1296 guild credit. There you go. Just realize one thing. When the pandemic ends, I have to go back to the office to work. Then I can't be watching you. Oh, really? I don't know if I'm going to go back to the office, to be honest. I don't know. I think I will maybe every now and then, but I don't know that I'm going to go back in regularly. Wait. What happened to all my clay? Wasn't I storing clay in here?
Uh, did I put it somewhere else? Oh, here it is. Okay, I have 48 clays. Nine mixed seeds. <clears throat> oh, the coffee bean. I keep forgetting to do this. Must plant coffee bean. Must plant. Okay, we'll just put it like right here. Uh, let me get some fertilizer or speed grow or something. I'm going to plant it alone. Keep forgetting about this. Um, speed grow. You want that? Or should I use a different one? Is that the only thing I have? <laughs> I guess that's the only thing I have. I thought I had something else. I guess not. Speed grow it is. Speed grow. I love Sebastian, though. I mean, yeah, I don't... There's some purple fertilizer. Okay. All right. Coffee bean is, is planted. Yeah, I mean, I uh, Sebastian seems cool. He seems, you know, like the your classic emo. Edgy, just a little edgy and you know, mysterious, right? Ooh, here's some grass to hopefully get some hay from. No, not at all. Did you know? Did you know? Cheers, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the guild, my new friend. Cheers to you. Gym's opening up hopefully means Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu is back on. Uh, that's not a I need to go to the gym situation for me. It's I get to go to the gym. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's cool. I love Sam. He's so cute with his pancakes and songwriting and that Super Saiyan hair, right? Chloe? Chloe? Cheers. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Here's to you. Yeah, I always, I just, I, when I think of Sam, I think of Super Saiyan hair. That's all I can think of. You can't actually see their, like, portrait. I wish you could, but. Pagino? Is it Pagino? Oh, what's going on, Moe? How you doing? Here's to you, Moe. Thank you so much for that sub for two months. Appreciate that. Moey, everybody. Moey 200. Can we get through Ender chat? Can we get there? I need those flames in the chat right now. Feel that hype? Let's go, baby. <laughs> good. How are you? Doing pretty well, Moey. Did you have a good weekend? Hopefully you did. Well, I can make some grass starter. Maybe I need to do that. My hay is probably running pretty low. 16 or so? Yeah, 16 pieces of hay. Okay, here's what I'm going to do first. I'm going to go look on Marnie's property. Of course, if we get these uh, fibers, we can make grass starter. But I'm going to go look on Marnie's property for some grass to chop down. Because again, it doesn't matter. You can, you can just go on anybody's property and start chopping trees, and they don't care. Buy hay? I could, I could, but remember... I'm trying to save these shekels, if you will. I gotta, I gotta build them up. I've got a decent amount of fiber. Let's see if we can find anything worthwhile here. I feel like I found grass down here before. I mean, if nothing else, these these will help me find some extra fibers. And they blend in so well to the ground. Sometimes I'm not even seeing them all. Um, grass starter makes them happier. Is that right? What is that purple blob? I think that's my, I think it's an iridium meteor that crashed down in my property. I think, but my pickaxe is not strong enough. I think I need a gold pickaxe to be able to crack it open. So, um, we'll see soon enough. Actually, you know what? I could start working on the gold pickaxe now that I'm thinking of it. I have enough gold bars, but it's 10,000 gold again. So it's just... It's that thing, like, like, do you upgrade? How do you know what to prioritize? It's 
tough. I really want that deluxe barn. I want to be able to start um, getting some wool for my sheep. Also, it comes with an auto feeder, which is pretty great. The deluxe barn does. So. Mm -hmm. Gold clock? Wait, gold clock? Hang on a second. The animals like being outside and they prefer eating grass, but it's always good to have hay in the barn too. Okay. So you, what you're saying is you plant grass starter and then you don't harvest it to get the hay. You just keep the grass starter. That makes that makes more sense, honestly, because you don't get um, you don't get one piece of hay for every grass starter and they could eat a grass starter every time. A spring onion. That's cool. Spring onion. Have I picked one of those before? I don't feel like I have. Yeah, well, not much here to be harvested in terms of grass. We did get a few more uh, fibers, so I can plant the grass starters. Okay. Fair enough. Buy hats, please. I did buy one. Actually, did I buy this hat? I think I bought this hat, the one I'm currently wearing. I really like it. I also have the Southwester hat, too. I really like that one. They're good, good hats. And I also just like buying from the hat mouse person. All right. Let me go plant these grass starters. Well, let me grab all my fibers so that I can then plant my grass starters. Oh, we got a pale ale ready. Spanky's in the bed. Look how cozy he is. All right. I can make nine grass starters. That's not very much, unfortunately. Not a lot. Okay. I'll just put them right alongside the building, I guess. Okay, we got some grass starter. Oh. All right, give me just a second here. I'm tired of this, like these weird spikes or dips, I guess you would say, in my network. I'm just gonna drop my, my uh, <clears throat> bit rate for a sec here. Hopefully we don't drop any more frames. Okay. Um. On lake type one. Need to play the non-standard maps. Oh, for that purple blob. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. Lake type one. Hmm. Aren't you streaming early today? Uh, yes. Technically, yes, I am because of daylight savings time ending. Um, we set our clocks forward on Saturday night, early Sunday morning. So, uh, yeah, normally it would be 8.15 right now. Uh, but but where I'm at now, it is currently 9.15. Prioritize, prioritizing is the hard part. You're 100% right, Lima Bean. There's so much stuff to do. How my animals outside, but they eat too much for the starters to take? Yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking, too. So, oh, wait. Okay, so the grass starter, if you just plant the grass starter, more grass will grow around it? Is that how that works? Yeah, it was a thing in the night, exactly. <laughs> that sounds... That sounds pretty interesting when you say it like that. It was a thing in the night. Tailored gold with Mayor Lewis's pants. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what a gold clock is either. Rare size and starter I've seen one streamer with. Also me. Huh. Grass starters will grow and spread, so that's a good start. Okay. Tread grass starter, and well, all my animals came out and ate it all. Yeah. A lot of grass. Okay. Did I miss resetting my clock? Um, I don't know. I don't think you guys are doing that just yet. I don't think so. Oh, wait. Gold bar. Let's do a couple things here. I did get the mushrooms out. Let's, uh, let's swap the mayonnaise out. Okay. And let's throw in a couple more eggs. Gotta try to get caught up on these. <clears throat> All right. 
That'll be three more mayonnaises. Okay. Um, what foraging items do I get? Wild horse radishes. Spring onion. I'm curious how much that'll be worth. And I'll store the rest of that stuff. Eh, let's, no, nobody, no, eh, I don't know. Probably should hang on, I should hang on to those. Dandelion. You can make a salad, I think, with dandelions. No. Throw the dandelions in here. Thought it was a worldwide thing, but it's not apparently. Yeah, we're not all on the same page, and it's pretty ridiculous, right? I think we should just we should just do away with daylight savings time. It's I, it's just not good. It's just not good. Nobody likes it. You know. Made your cow angry? How so? <clears throat> have I sold a pale ale? I don't know if I have. I'm gonna sell that too. Sell this as well. Again, we're trying to earn that money. 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 Trying to earn it. Okay. And yeah, sort of the maple syrup as well. Spanky boy. Sleeping underneath the dog. Accurate. I have a question for chat, but didn't want to spoil anything for loots. Oh. Yeah, see, there we go. I need some more 3,000 gold days. It's six mayonnaises. And that large milk, see? Large milk, 380 G uh, for the iridium. Gold cheese, 345. I just can't. I mean, there's no reason for me to make it into cheese at this point. So. Yes, he in time zones in general is a massive turd, right? <laughs> I know some people get upset when you call it daylight savings time instead of uh, daylight saving. Hmm. Daylight savings instead of daylight saving. Oh, I gotcha. With the S. Pretty stupid, too, in my opinion, resetting a clock twice a year. Again, it's like I said, like, I saw this a couple years ago. It's like, it's like you've got a blanket, right? And it doesn't quite cover your chest. It covers your feet, but not your chest. So you cut the feet off to sew it onto the chest. Your feet are still uncovered. Like, you don't have a longer blanket. You know what I mean? It's just... It's it's dark in the morning now, and, and lighter in the evenings. Like, it's the same thing. It was light in the evenings, or light in the mornings and dark in the evenings. Now it's the opposite, so... I, you know, I don't make these rules. Decided to sell all my stuff in Stardew? Oh, yeah? Decided to not turn my milk into cheese, too? Not sure if there's a perk other than having cheese for cooking? Yeah, I'm making those pizzas, right? Leek and vinegar. Ooh, I don't know that I've ever gotten vinegar before. Let's take a look at my other crafting schematics because I do this often where it's like, oh yeah, see I can make the oil maker. Makes gourmet truffle oil out of nothing or do I gotta put like mushrooms in there or something? I should definitely make that. And do some fertilizer. Uh, I still don't have any iridium bars yet but I really would love to make some Iridium Sprinklers. You go from eight adjacent tiles to 24 adjacent tiles, so. John Oliver had a why is this still a thing about DST a while back, I bet it was funny. My character stats are here. Nine farming, six mining, seven foraging, seven fishing, five combat. I love you, Mary Jane. Cheers, thank you for the follow. Cheers. Welcome to the guild. Why doesn't Iron Fence break in IRL? Uh, it would take almost 2,000 years. What's the next big game you're going to play? Uh, oh, I realized somebody asked me that. I don't think I actually gave you my schedule. So tomorrow, we're going to be playing No Man's Sky. Tomorrow's No Man's Sky. Uh, Wednesday, I have a dentist appointment in the morning, so I'm not going to be able to stream. I'm getting a cleaning. Um, my biannual, is that right? Twice a year? Twice a year cleaning. Um, I love you, Mary Jane Lutz. Now, it's funny because, uh, well, we all know what Mary Jane is, but also, um, like, my uh, <laughs> my sister-in-law's name is is that. So, yeah. So my brother-in-law might say, he might say that and mean something totally different than somebody else saying it. You know what I mean? So. <laughs> uh, so Tuesday, Thursday will be streams uh, of No Man's Sky. Friday, Valheim. That's, that's going to be the rotation for this week. 
Maybe you are still ahead of me. Uh, what type of mushroom the truffle oil maker requires? Oh, geez. I can I can probably guess. Uh, it's only part of the issue. Countries change DST at different times. True. Some places don't just change one hour. Certain places do two or a half. I even believe one place changes three quarters. Are you serious? One place changes time, so they are an entire different day because they are near the day line. Weird. Yeah, uh, there are certain parts of my state that <clears throat> of my state that never never uh, participate in a DST. They're just like, nah, we're good. We're set. Thanks for the offer. But uh, now they all do again. And so it was like a, it was a temporary thing, pretty much. It's like, how do you keep track of this? <laughs> it's just do we make this any more confusing? <laughs> Welcome in. I love you, Mary Jane. Cheers. I love Stardew Valley. It isn't. Isn't it just such a great game? Are you an avid Stardew Valley player yourself? These have got to be ready, right? Should I just... They won't... Will they? What happens if I just slash at one and it's not ready? Okay, we're good. We're good. They're not ready yet. But they don't get harvested, so it's fine. It's totally fine. Okay. They ate one of my grass starters. Oh, they ate a lot of grass starter. Yeah, this is going to be uh, kind of rough. Might actually have to buy hay, unfortunately. Every other day for goats, right? Okay. Lutz my goat has no milk right now. We do have goat cheese. Uh, literally, upstate New York is all of New York except Long Island. Still stuck on the fact that my Indian team members are five, five and a half hours ahead. Not five, not six, five and a half. Interesting. That is interesting. Okay. No, don't eat the large egg. Okay, let's throw... Where, oh, I didn't actually collect any hay. Okay. I have a link for a seven-year-old video talking about coding stuff regarding time, the issues with time zones and DST. Can I post that? No, it's fine. Wait, was that a different... Was that a response to the, the same video? I think he'd be able to post it. I played Stardew Valley all day yesterday and still felt like streaming it as well. What year are we on? This is year two. Just started year two. I'm uh, the 10th of spring in year two. Yeah, year eight. That's impressive. Year eight. Practically an old hand at this point. We got more torches to place. Oh, yeah. Just place a few. I don't know. I kind of like I like their I like the ambiance, you know. I like it. I have not watered Spanky in some time. I should probably do that. And if you're confused on Spanky, uh, Spanky is the name of my dog. Put one over here by the cave. It'll catch the bushes on fire. <clears throat> Spanky is the name of my dog. All right. It is a new day. What should I do? More smelting? Do I have anything to smelt? Soft cheese made from goat's milk. I'm curious how much that'll sell for. I haven't sold any yet. I have one saved for the, I believe, for donating. Let me do a quick check on that. Do, 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 do. Animal bundle. Don't know. Don't have any large goat milks yet, uh, but the wool and duck eggs I want to work on. So check on Abigail. I could do that. One of my favorite reviewers completely butchered No Man's Sky when it came out and never bothered checking it out after that. Is it worth it now? I've heard that. I've heard that it's been very good. So I'm excited to try it out. Favorite song is Mr. Blue Sky by Electric Light Orchestra. Is that right? 
Watering Spanky sounds like a euphemism. <laughs> yeah, you're not wrong. What new stuff happens by year eight? I need Skull Cavern tips. Ah. Oh, yeah. I've been hearing about Skull Cavern. Brother's like year eight, but that uh, that's because he doesn't get the game. Just keeps sleeping. <laughs> really? Dog hasn't been given water for three years. Yeah, I've been hearing that same thing, Nidalicious, that it's it's uh, much better now. Did I? I've not donated the goat cheese yet, so I can do goat cheese. I was hoping to get the truffle oil in there too. Uh, I need to find apples. I mean, I could plant an apple sapling, but cloth. Once I can get the loom up and running, I built the loom, and it was like I didn't really need to do that. Quality crops, though. I've got the parsnips ready to go, so all I got to do is get the melons in summertime, and I should be good on this. We'll have the greenhouse uh, by summer, I believe. Potentially fall if I don't find any apples before then, but you know. the fish tank though is a little bit tougher. I'm waiting for a rainy evening to catch an eel. So I think that's all I'm missing from the night fish. Uh, ocean fish, I need a tilapia. Lake fish, I need a carp and a sturgeon. And specialty fish, I need a sandfish and a wood skip. So I'm still kind of far on the glittering boulder getting removed. And then the bulletin board, I'm even further, which is just friendship. <laughs> you get friendship for, for doing all these, so. Uh, never found an aquamarine. I'm sure I could get a duck feather at some point. Uh, maki rolls, not too difficult to make. There's a truffle right there. So, yeah, I don't know. It's just, uh, I, don't, I don't feel very close to these. The three apples, pomegranate, rabbit foot, wine. I have wine I can bring for that, but. Yeah, those are the three I've got left. Those are the three I've got left. <clears throat> do you like the concept, but still not so sure for some reason? I got you. Well, you can see how, how we do in it, I suppose, and then try to decide after that, dice by vice. To plant sapling seeds needs 24 tiles of clear space. Yeah, it's a lot. It does need a ton of space. Um, grow with one tile on each side. A lot of place for a tree. Yeah, let's go see. Um, check on Abigail. That was one of the things that... That would be a good thing to do. Let's see if I've got a gift I can give her. Any amethyst? No. Okay, I don't have any amethyst. Do I have a recipe for a chocolate cake? Neutral? Um, is it going to rain tomorrow? Nope. Do I have a recipe? I don't think I have a recipe for a chocolate cake. She likes... Uh, blackberry cobbler pumpkin i don't think i have pumpkin though spicy eel chocolate cake amethyst i don't know that i can make any of these feature spreadsheet from one year ago for stardew got it for 20 dollars on a steam sale oh okay for for uh no man's sky i guess uh 20 dollars on a steam sale and put it about 80 invested engaged and entertained hours into it Almost missed work. Nice. Okay. Plant some fruit tree next to my pond and it still grew. Ah. Catch a stream tomorrow if I can and maybe I'll give it a shot. Nice. There you go. It's trees and crops. Okay. All right. Blackberry cobbler. Can I make spicy eel, blackberry cobbler, or a chocolate cake? I don't think I can make any of those. I don't think I have the recipes. That looks like it would be a chocolate cake right there. I don't have it. Um, blazed yams, sashimi, maki roll. Hmm. There's a pumpkin pie. Would she like that? I mean, I have the pumpkin, so I can just give her the pumpkin. Uh, I'll just do that. I have one pumpkin to give, so I'll give it to Abigail. We got to get that, uh, what, sixth heart? Sixth heart. We got to get that sixth heart. And while I'm out, I suppose I'll donate to the museum. I think I've got two things. Skeletal tail and fire quartz. Might as well. Nice spreadsheet. I'll have to check that out. Will she be working in the store? Oh, no, she won't because the store is closed today. I'm guessing you can't go in the store even if it's closed, right? Running low on sandfish? 
Sandy wants a sandfish? I'll accept, but I'm not bringing you that. It's Vincent's birthday. Yeah, you can't go in. So they live in there. That's interesting. You can't go visit your friends on Wednesdays. Respectfully disagree, sir, but it may be, maybe it's my mods, but I don't think so. Wait, which part? Are you talking about the trees? Do, 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 do. I could try it. Although, like I said, I'm still trying to save up for that barn. Really, really want the barn. Abigail is sometimes up here. She's sometimes at the cemetery as well. Let's see if we can find her. Otherwise, I can go see the museum. I should do that soonish anyway. Six by four area. Uh, you can buy them, but I think it's only during a certain season. Oh, yeah. Hmm. I did purchase a... What did I purchase? I purchased a puffer fish, I believe, in the winter market. Or at the winter market. So. Hmm. No Abigail anywhere. Let's go ahead and make sure I don't miss the donation window for the museum. Every now and then I see her walking around. Here, have a daffodil for your birthday. A birthday gift? That's very kind of you. I love it. Why not? I just saw him, so figured might as well. Should be wooing, wooing Linus. Oh, there she is. Found her. I know. I wish I could. Need a mod for that. All right. Fire quartz. And rib thing. Got a new reward. What lame reward did we get? Oh, a rare crow. Nice. Okay. It looks like a raccoon meowth kind of rare crow. <laughs> Penny. Can't wait till the dawn of the th uh, your dawn of the third year. Is that right? Fruit trees are pretty useless anyways. Barn is way cooler. Is that right? I've been wanting to, I wanted to build one. I mean, I could build one in, or build one. I could plant one at the beginning of summer. Oh, hi, Luth. Taking a break from your work? I see you. Me too. Oh, nothing physical. Just some online classes I'm taking. Nice. Okay. Give her this pumpkin. I seriously love this. You're the best, Luz. She's been saying that a lot lately. But uh, there we go. There's the sixth heart. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's getting serious. So I really need to get her the spicy eel and the blackberry cobbler, I think. To get those last two hearts. That's what I'm thinking. So... Have I seen the shrine in Piers? I have, yeah. Uh, fruit trees from the wiki. Each fruit tree must be planted in the center of a clear 3x3 ground area in order to grow, though they may be placed next to permanent structure, i.e. house or greenhouse. The 3x3 area must remain clear of objects, flooring, and terrain features, including grass, otherwise the tree will not grow. Huh. Neck okay? Yeah, it's fine. I was just trying to pop it. Just trying to crack it. I don't know if... I don't know if I got any cracks in me. Probably not. <laughs> All right. I wish I would have saved my conversation with Abigail for after I gave her the gift. And is this book actually here? I feel like I read this. Um, okay. Dolok Ulan Paino Rakoto Ulan Koto Vlan Mabo Bel Eno. Oh, okay. Hang on a second. Uh, if you look at all the capital letters, let's see. Super C V Super C U C U M Super Cucumber Town Super Cucumber Town Duck May Mayo. Saloon. Duck Mayo Saloon? What? 
Super Cucumber Town. Duck Mayo Saloon. Ran Strange. Buntoy. B. Okay, what is this? Strange. B U N T O Y B O X. Okay. Bun Toy Box. Strange Bun Toy Box? Uh, what? <laughs> okay, so we got Super Cucumber Town. Duck Mayo Saloon. Super Bun Toy Box. What does that mean? <sighs> okay. Big fan that you actually read out loud. Oh, yeah, you know. Kind of doesn't matter that much what you give specifically to them as long as you're frequent with giving two gifts each week. Oh, is that right? Okay. Yeah, and that's what I've tried doing. I feel like I've given Abigail two gifts every week for a while. But watching Lutz sip that coffee actually makes me want to try the caramel macchiato pods I got. What if I have coffee after lunch and not sleeping that night? Ooh. Read that like a pro. Did I actually? Or are you guys messing with me here? Sounds like my three-year-old nephew reading, right? Translates to real wor words that make sense. I'm an avid decoder. Strange bun is a food item, but that's all I got. Strange bun is a food item, huh? So I maybe I need to take a strange bun to a toy box? And then duck mayo? I take to the saloon? Or is it duck comma mayo? Duck mayo? I mean, I guess, oh, well, I mean, if ducks lay eggs and you throw it into the mayonnaise machine, that would make sense. So maybe I need to get duck mayo, strange bun, and a super cucumber. I don't know what the heck a super cucumber is. But, uh, and that one's just in town. So, sure. Okay. Okay. Look that book up on the wiki. There's a trick to it. It's the caps. Yeah, yeah, I read all the caps, Fry Guy. I got them all. Do, 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 do. Give this daffodil to, pen a daffodil to Penny. Thanks, this looks nice. That was a normal gift, obviously. Thanks for the enthusiasm. Do, 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 do. Yeah, right, I just read it out loud. Didn't you hear me? I read it out. Super Cucumber Town, Duck Mayo Saloon, and uh, Strange Bun Toy Box. Super cucumber is a fish? Oh, like the sea cucumbers? There's a super sea cucumber? Let me plant this rare crow. <laughs> I like this one. Uh it's not it does it's not gonna serve any real purpose there, but I'm gonna put it there anyway. I like it. I'm gonna save my coffee beans. I haven't encountered any crows. Let's see if any of them say, scared off any crows. No, too many of them. The the the, the, scro <laughs> the crows aren't even coming near the scarecrows right now. Okay. More eggs. Alrighty. Identified by the red cape. <laughs> red cape. Oh gosh. Okay, if that's a real thing, I'm going to laugh really hard if we catch that. And it seriously is a sea cucumber in a red cape. <laughs> did I get the mushrooms from today? I don't feel like I did. I don't feel like I did. But maybe? I did not. All right. Ooh, got some pine tar. Pine tar. Okay. Storing the pine tar, since I know I can use that for crafting, or at least I could. We've got pine tar, maple syrup, and oak resin all stored away, just in case. I feel like maple syrup is something I'm going to need for... Uh, some culinary stuff. 
Let's make another pale ale. Did I actually make a note of how much the pale ale was worth? I don't think I did. It's gonna be a Marvel spin-off series. <laughs> uh, you do get mushrooms every day, yep. You sure do. Isn't that nice? I need it to be a rainy day sometime. I can catch some dang eel. Hey, Spanky boy. Sitting where the rice died. Because I could plant another rice. Yeah, it's pretty nice, though, to get mushrooms every day. It's like you can, you, you know, you earn at least a little bit of money every day. As long as you remember to pick them, which I don't always. I'm going to do a little ocean fishing. Little ocean fishing. And if I catch a tilapia, that'd be cool. I need that. What if I fish from the shore? Would that be good? Or should I always fish at the dock? I should have looked for bubbles to do that. I went with mushrooms. Darn, I chose the bats and it's rubbish. Ah, see, I chose the bats originally too. And I was convinced to, uh, but I chose it like you chose, you choose it right in the morning. So I was convinced to, to reload my save. I'm glad I did. I knew I needed bat wings and I was like, oh, I should, okay, I should do that then. A 16 inch anchovy, no freaking way. Bats get you fruit, is that right? All right, do we see any bubbles anywhere? I don't so far. Hmm, no bubbles. It'd be great if I could find some. I only recently learned that bubbles increase the catch frequency. But that's all right. Let's fish from here. Okay, they do get you fruit. It's not consistent. Hmm. Mushrooms make life elixir. That's pretty OP. Yeah, you're not wrong about that. I haven't made any life elixir, though. But I do know, like, it gives you full health just by... <laughs> just by one drink. I could really use some more, uh... Fish biting frequency. Another anchovy. Iridium anchovy. <clears throat> Forgot to check mine on a regular basis, so when I do, there's a ton. Oh, okay. Go days and no fruit. Oh, ruined my perfect catch. Those halibut butt fish. Good night, Willie. Have a good evening. Dang it. That was my fault. Just totally overplayed it. 14 inch anchovy. So yeah, if I don't get the perfect catch, then it's not an iridium. It's not iridium. And I haven't done any max casting either. Gold star cheese is my life elixir. It's pretty good. I do like that stuff. I mean, it's, it's pretty easy to milk your cow every day and then just throw it in a machine. All right, we gotta go for the gift. Oh no! I almost blew that. Really, I thought I did. A nine inch anchovy. What do we get? 10 gold ores, that was worth it. That was worth it. Gold ore is still pretty rare for me. Um, are you planning on finishing this? That was a little late. I took my hand off the mouse for whatever reason. Finishing this game with a certain event or something since it doesn't really have an ending. Uh, I haven't I haven't really decided what I'm going to do with it. I mean, I, I will say I'm, I'm not planning on playing Stardew forever. So I do have to have a plan eventually, but for now I'm just enjoying the chillness, you know? For the time being, at least. This will be my last cast. Now 
That was an easy one. A 20 inch herring. Did that give me a, it was an iridium one, okay. All right. Well, not gonna make it home early, but I shouldn't pass out. That's good. I wanna keep finding these library books as well. I don't know how many, I don't know how many there are total, but. Hey, welcome back in, Seal Pup Clubber. Oh. Is she crying? Abigail. Or is she just chilling? She's got a sword. Oh no, she's laughing. I guess you're wondering why I'm in the graveyard at this hour. Oh, a little bit. Well, I'm here because it's the best place in town to find some privacy. Well, not anymore. And I'm all sweaty because I've been practicing my swordsmanship. Oh? Hey, what? You think I'm too weak to swing a blade? No, I didn't say that. Sorry, I guess I'm getting a little defensive. You see, I want to explore the mountain caves, but I know it's too dangerous to go there unarmed. You've used a sword before, haven't you? Yes, and it's exciting, but only in self-defense. Yes, but it's dangerous. You should stay safe. No. Yes, and it's exciting. Decided I'm done after completing the community center myself, but some people do after year three or marrying or whatever. Lots of opportunities. Yeah, definitely. Did you say not anymore? <laughs> it's a good place to get some quiet time, right? A little privacy in the cemetery. Yeah. A little bit, uh... You're just a little bit wrong, but... Hey, what's going on, Curry? How you doing? Yes, and it's exciting to use a sword. See? You understand why I'm out here, then. I've lived in the valley my whole life, but I've never really done anything memorable. I want to go on an adventure. Same. Abigail. Oh, Pierre coming to ruin everything. Dad? Uh-oh. I've been looking all over for you. Your mother wants you to come home and help with dinner. It's like midnight, Pierre. What are you doing in this graveyard anyway? This is no place for a young lady. Never completed Stardew? Mind your own business. You think I should be at home cooking dinner because I'm a girl, don't you? Oh. Oh, go off, queen. Go off. You're really stuck in the past, dad. Oh. <laughs> Look at his face. Let's get out of here, loots. Ooh, together? Are we going to my place? Am I reading things wrong? Well, are you coming or not? Yes. Yes, how do I follow? Okay, good. Come back! <laughs> Coats slept in. All good. All good. A wizard is never late. Nor is he early. He arrives precisely when he means to. Or she. Or they. Arrive precisely when they mean to. <clears throat> Honestly, I want to start a new one from scratch and experience the whole game. I mean, that's kind of what I'm doing. But it's good. I would recommend it. Okay, my dad won't find us here. Oh, can you believe my parents were ever young? They don't understand my perspective at all. I know, I know. They grew up in a different era with different values. It still ticks me off sometimes, okay? Oh, I'm with you. Well, thanks for hearing me out, Lutz. Um, now, could you help untangle my hair from this bush? <laughs> we were hiding in a bush together? All right, well, I dig it. What do you guys think of my midnight encounter with Abigail? Did we play it cool? Steel Pup Clubber, cheers to you. Cheers. <laughs> Raunchy. <laughs> oh, hang on. Got to sell this stuff. Ah, oh, my spice berry did make jam. Selling all the fish I caught. Uh, I'll hang on to the seaweed and clay. I don't have coal with me, so I'm not gonna... Oop. That's nice. Keep forgetting it does that. 
Score the clay, the gold ore. It's one o'clock. I'm ignoring the clock. It'll be fine. Totally fine. Spiceberry jelly. Interesting. Okay. Clay goes in here. I think we got enough time to sell the spiceberry jelly. I think so. Should have ended with a kiss. Yeah, that would have been nice, huh? Wouldn't it? All right. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. 2100 on the farming. Not bad. Not bad. See if we keep having more 3000 uh, G days like this. Spiceberry jelly was worth 210. That goat cheese, though, 400 for just regular standard goat cheese. I like it. Catch you later, Magoots. Good luck wooing Abby. I will do my best. Mary Jane, cheers. Thanks again for the follow. Appreciate you stopping in. Have a good rest of your day. Every time I see Abigail, I'm reminded of the betrayal in her eyes when I broke up with her for Penny. Ugh. That's sad. <laughs> Goat cheese is nice. Is nice. Forging, though. Not bad. Found a purple mushroom in the cave, which is worth 250 which is great. The daffodil's not worth a lot, but the fish, really not worth a lot, you know? They just aren't worth a ton. All right. Ooh. I don't know. Today, it might be kind of tight here for today's. I'm going to do it, though. I'm going to do my best. I'm going to do my best to, to make it through this day. I got a meeting starting in, like, 20 minutes. <laughs> and if I'm a few minutes late, it's probably okay. What kind of goat cheese? Uh, that was just standard goat cheese. Lo Lutz Magoat goat cheese. Ooh, a gold star goat milk already. Lutz Magoat isn't even that old. Already producing that quality content. We got an iridium milk, which again, will not turn into mayonnaise. Just not worth it. It already, I did pet all my chickens. Okay. Uh, cow's still doing okay. Cow and goat. Okay. Uh, should I make? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Maybe I'll get a gold star goat cheese out of that. We'll see. Speed run. I forgot to swap out the mayonnaise, didn't I? Or did I? I don't know. The iridium eggs, though. Making heck of irid uh, iridium eggs lately. I have freaking, what, 28 eggs in there, and that's 29? Yeah, I'm sort of overloaded on eggs right now, but it'll be all right. It'll be okay. It'll eventually get caught up. It's gonna be a while. Iridium milk doesn't make iridium cheese. It does not. Um, I was told that I have to upgrade my house in order to get iridium stuff from the presses. That's what I was told, at least. I do not know. Uh, what you guys think of goat cheese is like, is one of like hundreds of goat cheese. I'm blanking on its name. Oh, okay, okay. All right, here's all that stuff. What should I do on this fine day? I actually got all my stuff done before 9 a.m. That's impressive. Uh, except for, I should check on the chickens. Hey, I think they're probably covered. But I should check on it anyway. Yep, they're good. And then these guys still have hay, right? Didn't I see that in here? Yeah. Cool, cool. Okay. Got everything done before 9 a.m. Uh, I should take a look at the luck today and maybe hit up the mines. The mines would be a good way to make time go by quick. And maybe if it rains, it's never going to rain again, is it? Okay. Lucky day. Item spotlight crab pot. Experienced anglers know how to craft crab pots. Despite the name, the pots can be used to catch a wide variety of aquatic critters in both fresh and salt water. Just place your crab pot in the water and load with bait. 
Come back the next day, check on it, and see what you caught. You'll need to load it with bait again to catch more. I should try to make my crab pot somewhere else, so. Don't you think? Um, okay. Yeah, we're gonna go to the mines today. I'm gonna store some of this stuff right quick that I don't need. I'll hang on to the iridium rod. Maybe I'll find, I don't know. No, maybe not. Okay. Obsidian edge. I don't, do I need the scythe? I needed the scythe last time, but not the axe. And the watering can. Okay. And the milk pail. Uh, the coffee, again, I'm saving for the uh, egg hunt. We'll go with that. All right, here we go. Mining day it is. Mining day it is. And what am I at? 13,000? Okay, so that's about what I started the day with. A little bit more than I started the day with. And I purchased the backpack upgrade. So that's, I mean, I can't be too upset about that. You know? Comforting music. Am I right? All right. Oh, I keep forgetting. I have the mine carts too. Uh, I can just use that from the bus stop. All right. Can we get to level 100 today? I think we can. Unless I just am a sucky suck at this, which I mean, I could be. We'll look for any specific. Ores laying around? Oh! I'm really glad I got this obsidian edge. Give me the crab! We found a crab! Just a regular fish, though. That's all it's counted as. I'm gonna beat you to the ladder, Mr. Bat. Get wrecked. Good, good, good. We can see we got a minecart path down here, but it is blocked. So, kind of interesting. Making strides, we're trying. Mr. Blue Sky? Oh, is that the name? Is that the video you were talking about earlier? The song? Oh, yeah. We still got to collect that gold ore. Really? That's not hitting him? Ooh, these guys are tough because... Why is my energy already so low? Did I not get a good night's sleep? These guys, I feel like they continue pursuing even if you hit them. Probably gonna be eating some uh, purple mushrooms while we're down here. I think so. Yeah, these ones do a lot more damage too. Oh, come on. Come on. I'm losing it here. Hey, I don't like how they continue pursuing me like that. That is just not fair. You're getting stabbed with a sword and you're like, oh, I'm just going to keep on coming. That doesn't seem right. You guys are almost unstoppable when they leap at you. All right. Honestly, love cheese, and I know a lot about food since my dad was a chef, so I get to learn a lot about food. Nice, okay. You want to listen to Mr. Blue Sky? I haven't listened to it. I'll listen to it after the stream, though. My childhood song when it was a rainy day back in 1977. Nice. Very nice. I can dig that. I'm going to listen to it for sure. Mr. Blue Sky. I'm, I wonder if I've heard it before. I feel like I probably have. Oh no, not the mages. Ooh, a secret note though. Ah, oh, dang it. I'm sucking at the combat today. I'm not doing so hot. Gotta get one more level down to 95 at the very least. Okay. 
Looks like we're going to find a diamond as well. Okay. Always nice finding a diamond. Always nice. We'll never turn it down. All right, there's level 95. Level 95. Oh, what? What in the heck is this? What was that? It looked like a moon that shot. It looked like a small moon. That's no moon. Huh. Well, okay. Can we get to level 100? That is my goal. That is my goal now. Area is overrun with monsters. Oh, yeah, you're not freaking kidding. I'm going to try to get full health. Ah. Oh, these guys were the worst. Probably not actually, but... I have to keep an eye on this. Oh, I suck at swinging the sword today. Just doing terrible. Here we go. Okay, let's read some secret notes. Penny's handwriting. <clears throat> Just kidding, I'm only 23. <laughs> Thought you were 50 for a second. Sounds like an ELO version of I Am The Walrus, as it was written in at Peak Acid Trip, right? Imagine time freezing every time you eat. Wouldn't that be great? Like classic rock 60s, 70s, and 80s music. Nothing wrong with that. Personal favorite older band Led Zeppelin, hands down. Ah, Led Zepp. Little Led Zepp, huh? Little stairway to heaven. I want to get something, uh, I want to get everyone something they love. Mom, parsnip, glazed yams, no beer. <laughs> As in, I think her mom is Pam. Jazz, fairy rose, uh, plum pudding, Vincent, pink cake, grape, Mr. Molnar, leek, fried mushroom, that's George. Uh, Granny Molnar, beet, tulip. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Oh, that was only one secret note. I need to read the other one. 12 o'clock, noon sharp. Last day of the season. Check the bush above the playground. Okay. Last day of the season. I'll have to remember that. How do I set a reminder for myself? It's going to be a little bit before I get to the last day of the season, but... Oh, that's, see, that's what I'm talking about right there. Let them get slightly out of range. Do we have any worms in here? No. Here we go. Level 97. Getting close. Getting real close. Absolutely no stairway to heaven. <laughs> See, Penny is so sweet, right? Have you had... Juan Bonham on the drums, though? Oh, heard? Okay. Uh, does that register in the friendship tracker? Do you have to remember it? Uh, so if you go into the socials, like, who was somebody that said George? So you can see his love gifts right here. So it added him. It's pretty nice. Sucks he died, yeah. Blacked Out is probably their best song. Oh, yeah? Cam Zeppelin without him, yeah. John Mellencamp, Jack and Diane. Oh, is that it? Is that your song right there? After Mr. Blue Sky? Two more levels. At, I mean, three levels I've got to get to still. I am running the heck out of time. Is this Ruby? Yeah, it is. Heck yeah, it is. And a secret note in a rock? I'm hoping there's a ladder over here because I didn't see one anywhere else. What do we think about going for broke and passing out in the mines? What do we think about it? Actually, shouldn't there shouldn't be an excuse for passing out in the mines anymore now that the mine carts are repaired. I should be pretty good. These guys are just the freaking worst. 
Ooh, got a lot of stuff. Hundred and nine damage? Are you serious? My sword really do all that? Uh oh. Gonna get hit right here too. Oh, look at that! Didn't get hit. Man, gonna give uh, loots a little more credit. There we go. Oh, I'm not even gonna go up there. Screw that. Okay. We should just go for broke. We'll just have to go for broke. Not a huge Melon Camp fan? Oh, no? That's right. You know, honestly, like, I, I don't necessarily listen to that music on my own, but, you know, if my dad's listening to it, or when he used to, he used to listen to the classic rock a lot on the radio, and I'd go with him to jobs and stuff like that. Uh, my dad's a carpenter, so occasionally he would bring me on for, like, some help. Um... You know, I kind of grew a fondness to that. Just makes you think of time spent with your dad, you know? Ooh, this could be bad. Don't like them. I don't. And I don't like those guys either. We could get some coal. I suppose. Six pieces of coal, I guess, for free. That's very exciting. Should I read this other secret note? Ooh, an Omni Geode? Okay. Read the secret note. If you can read this, come to Secret Woods. Please bring Maypal Syrup. <laughs> Time check? Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, unfortunately, I'm, I'm kind of running over right now. Got into Tool only a few years ago, and I feel like one gets mocked for being a Tool fan these days. Oh, you Tool Tool. Nah, it's all good. Tool's good. You like punk music? I like Tool. Off for the night. Bye. Moe, thanks for coming in. Thanks for dropping the sub. Appreciate you stopping in, dude. Hope you have a great night. Do we have the same father? Probably. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> Is your father a carpenter that listens to uh, classic rock on the way to jobs as well? Ooh, there's a magma geode? Yeah, it's called magma geode. I need to get one more freaking level down. One level. And then the adventurers will know I'm the real deal. No, uh, is this is this just gonna be a real spirally level here? Seems like it. Another magma geode. Those seemed exciting, but I just got stone from it last time. Kinda sucked. Comes the bat, nice and slow. Look at all that stuff in the middle. Oh, is that Iridium for a change? Or is that Amethyst? I think I've thought that before and ended up being Amethyst. Three hours till blackout, I know. I know, now I'm at two hours. Oh my. At least those guys only take one hit. Come on, Luch, you gotta move faster! Yes, he is. Nice. That's awesome. It's Amethyst. Okay, we can still live with that. What sort of funsies are we gonna find in here? Gotta keep an eye on my health, too. I'm kinda... Flipping. Come on, one hour to find the freaking ladder. I killed all the enemies. No ladder showed up. Oh my gosh, you're kidding me, right? This is a joke. I don't even care about the stone. Pass out imminent.
You know it's gonna happen too. Maybe the bat will open a ladder? Nope. Freaking didn't. Why is this happening? Ah! Oh, that's terrible. Engage biting of nails. Get for Abigail. It's true. I did get that at least. Yeah, that sucks. This is the worst map. Welcome in Silent One. I gotta go all the way back from 95 down. Ugh. Ugh. Pale Ale's ready. What about anything else? Oh yeah, all these are ready to be harvested. Sweet. Okay. That'll have to be for next time. 1000 G for this service from a Joja customer satisfaction representative. Not a butthole. Egg festivals tomorrow. Okay. All right. Well, The worst is dying in the mines. Is that right? Fission mailed. Yeah, that really did suck. Um, unfortunately, I have to I have to dart because my meeting starts in two minutes. Let me give out these thank yous, though, because I'm not going to miss all these. We got a bunch of follows today, so I want to make sure everybody is recognized for their willingness to follow. If this button will work, do it. Um, well, OK, it is not working. So let me just give thank yous myself then. Uh, we got a bunch of follows. We got a follow from from Robzy, Michael W13, Tateress, Lima Bean, Blappin Shad, Pagino, Chloe, and I love you, Mary Jane. We also got a resub from Moe200. So cheers to all of you guys. Thank you so much for the follows and for hanging out with me today. For some reason, that just it was not triggering showing all of the uh follows today, so I don't know why, but here's to you all. Thank you guys so much for hanging out. I am so sorry I have to dart like this, uh, but like I said, my meeting is starting soon. Three away from 300. Nice, nice, nice. 300 followers crazy in his stream. What would be the craziness, nice? My friends, I must go. Hope you guys have an amazing, amazing rest of your Monday. I'll be back again tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be No Man's Sky. Um, assuming nothing goes wrong with my installation, we'll be playing No Man's Sky tomorrow, so... Thank you guys so much. Fun day of Stardew today. I will catch you tomorrow. Have a great Monday. Bye.